Um, just eating some pickles, cheese, and crackers. These are the new. <coughs> these are the new uh, Swiss crackers made by Ritz. Ritz, or not, not made by Ritz. Uh, Hang on. Uh, I should know this. Uh, Fuck! Hey. Uh. They're they're red. Yeah, they are. Here, you just show the box. <laughs> they're made by Christie, but the Ritz Swiss cheese crackers. Christie. Christie's the company. The. Yeah, and the Ritz. Is the name brand. Yeah, the Ritz, Ritz crackers. Okay, can you put those against the wall? You guys probably didn't give a fuck about that. Uh, today's Wednesday. It's hump day. We've been banging. That's all we did today. Bang, 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 bang. Eh? Fucking right. Uh, actually, we didn't just bang. Donna was booting the boot for a while. Uh... Before Donna tells you one of her tales, we're smoking tuna kush from Kootenai Botanicals. It's really good stuff, gives you the munchies, and that's what Donna's smoking right now, right? A joint. Yeah. Donna's, Donna's puffing on a joint. <laughs> she loves sucking on things. Daddy. <laughs> uh, <coughs> so the first story Donna has is something about pieces of road. Okay. The whole, I don't know if there's any good roads to drive on really right now. I, I really don't, but. Hang on. Before she continues, I almost forgot. If you aren't subscribed, hit the fucking subscribe button. And hit the thumbs up button too. Hey? Just figured I'd mention it. <laughs> okay, go ahead. Um. Okay, so I'm, co I'm coming home, and I was... Anyways, if you're from the Timmins area, I need to say this. When, if you, if you go across from, like, if you're coming from Food Basics, and you go across the road, and instead of turning into Tim Hortons, you go up and around that windy thing. Yeah. Just go straight, because you will never, to make that turn there, if there's a vehicle, like, at the stop sign, going to turn. I should save you a couple. Eh? Mm -hmm. you'll, you'll never do it. The the Right there, the whole fucking road's just torn right the fuck up. Anyways, nobody was coming, so I managed to go around it, right? I'm coming down fucking six, right? Past Hilltop, going close to the, like, where the stop sign is, but not at the stop. There's chunks of fucking road on, on the road. There's big fucking, like... Chunks of road on the road! Big triangle. What the fuck? Yeah, I had to fucking weave around it because... You uh, had to weave around it? Yeah, I would have took out That's the no good. bottom of the car. Huh. That's all you got for that story? Yeah, the huh. fucking... She had to weave around some road that was on the road. Yeah, I don't even know where the fucking road came from because there was nothing. <laughs> Somebody just left some road laying around. <laughs> if anybody's missing some road, it's up on the road. <laughs> I don't know where it came from. Okay, well, speaking of roads, your next uh, story also has to do with roads, Donna. Something about filling potholes, the city filling Yeah, potholes. what the, okay. <laughs> I don't fucking understand this. For the life of me, I don't understand this. It's, you know, at the top of uh, <coughs> the hill, Ross? Yeah. There were that, where it's all, going that way is okay. This way, though, there's always, it's a big fucking mess over there. Well, what's worse now, there's big holes fucking everywhere. So what did the city fucking decide to do? Decide to fucking fill the holes in the fucking rain with water fucking splashing all over. And then it's going to be gone in two fucking days. Watch. Cocksuckers. It's a big eh? fucking mess everywhere. Like, I don't know. And Speaking what? of holes getting filled, I filled a few holes myself this morning. There's, um. Okay, and something else I want to fucking point out. Stop. <laughs> 
Um, I went to get a coffee, uh, like around at um, the Hortons. Yeah, that was around like three, a little bit after three ish. Eh? Yeah, she's drinking a Hortons coffee, and I got a Molson Canadian. What beer's all a boot, eh? Uh. Yeah. Okay. So there, it's busy at that. It's busy everywhere at three o'clock. There's like fucking schools all over the place, and crossing guards, and school buses, and all that fucking shit. Okay, um, so this is what fucking happened. So there's a, a vehicle in front of me, and then there's me here, okay? And, okay, and the city has, I, I don't know what the fuck they were doing because they were trying to work on this section here, but cars were still allowed to fucking, they, the cars had to go around. I don't know how you're supposed to go around when you, there's, un, there's fucking traffic coming that way, right? Anyway, so that vehicle goes, so it's next, right? So I'm really fucking paying attention, right? Because I noticed the, the crossing guards on both sides, right? No, they're, you know, like, they usually have, like, probably, like, a thing, like, maybe, like, say if you were a crossing guard and I was a crossing guard, okay? We probably have our, like, uh, you know, maybe a nod, like, okay, we're going to go this way and then we'll take care of these kids over here type of thing. Okay. No communication at all. So the, the person behind me actually fucking beeped, but what do you want me to do? I have this lady crossing guard lady over here, right? And I guess the 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 crossing guards both have to come out and meet, right? Hold their signs up. So this lady's here trying to get this kid across. The guy that was here, he decides he's going over on this side now to fucking try to help another fuck. Anyways, the the whoever is behind me, fucking, what do you want me to do? I'm not gonna fucking hit a kid. Like I fucking, it took me a, a good fucking two three minutes to figure out. Do I fucking turn or don't I turn? Do I or don't I? There was no communication with them. No communication. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Donna went to the beer store for me this morning when she was oot and a boot. And my fuck. What and her a fuck. fuck. There was, I was like, I pull in there, I was like, oh fuck, there's only, there was a cab. Uh, in the in the parking lot, right? But no, I was like, oh, okay, well, fuck, like, good, like, I can look at it rain. Anyways, uh, so there's this this kind of <coughs> old guy, but he's like, that's better, eh? Fucking right. He asked for beer. I know this. Because the guy on the other side, where you know where they roll it down to you? Yeah. He's over there with the the case, the, or whatever it was, the can. Different, there was cans, I just seen cans. He can't fucking figure out the pin. I seen lots of cans this morning. And he's, <laughs> the, <laughs> two. <laughs> well, there was more than two. There was like eight or ten or something. <coughs> You're gonna get a boot. <laughs> you can't figure out I seen two, any. I seen two cans flopping around. <laughs> <laughs> okay, go ahead with your story. Ah, <coughs> uh, he can't remember his fucking pin. Okay. Yeah. So the girls like it tells you once you push that button, it tells them that it's declined or what or wasn't it or right. So then he's, he gets mad, like he, the girl's like, no, it's not that, it, it, sir. He's like, well, what the fuck is my pin? <laughs> well, she's like, oh, I, I don't I don't know what your pin is, sir. Well, how the fuck So he, he expected the lady that was working at the beer store to know his pin? Yeah, or to help him with his pin that he couldn't figure out. Cause the well, pin, how the fuck is she going to help I him? don't fucking, she's like, sir, I can't, I, I don't know what your pin is. <laughs> was he is. drunk? I don't know, he came there in a cab. He's probably drunk. And she's like, she kept on like looking over at like the other employee, like, you know, like this, I don't know how long it was there for, but I was like, oh, like, just fucking please hurry up to, so then she's like, okay, well I can help you up to, like as a, as a whatever, you could say, okay, if they have trouble with savings or checkings, right? She's like, okay, so he goes to put in the pin. She's like, no, sir, you need four, it's four digits. <laughs> how many did you put in? Three. <laughs> Three, three, and then she's like, it's going to lock out your card. Like, you know, when you try to attempt to put in your pin for so many times, right? And then it just 
locks your card like you have to pull the bank. Well, he didn't fucking care. He still tried fucking three numbers on a four-digit fucking pin for her to say, no, sir. Okay, he says, and fucking gets out, gets back in the cab, and just fucking leaves. <laughs> Maybe you should to have that tap on your card. Should have that tap on your card. Um. <laughs> I'm just going to uh, fill up my bowl, and I'm gonna grab another beer. So I'll be right back. You keep talking. Another though. thing I'd like to uh, point out. What else do you want to point out? The only thing I had on my list there that was left uh -huh. was uh, I was gonna mention how icy the roads were and how you went and helped that lady this morning across oh, yeah, the street. Oh yeah, I'll tell that story after this one because huh? I need to get this one off my chest. So All morning it's been about nothing but your chest, Donna. Eddie, stop it. <laughs> there is. Okay, I, I'm coming back from the other side of town, right? I drive, I drove Justin to work. Yeah. So I'm coming back. And once again, there's an East Indian cab driver. Vets, he's in a vet's car. Right? <clears throat> yeah. He's, and he's in front of me. Yeah. So we take the turn, right? Mm -hmm. And to get back onto Riverside. Mm -hmm. And he goes, first he's in front of me, and then he decides, oh, he's going to go into the slow lane, which was fine, because he wasn't doing the speed limit anyways. Uh -huh. And then, you know where the lights are to the mall? Yeah. So there's like, you have the slow lane, the faster lane, right? Mm -hmm. And then you have the little, the little part of the lane where you go into turn left into that area. Yeah. Do you know what I'm talking about? Yeah. The fucking... So we're driving along. There's a black truck, actually. He was fucking really speedy. He was way ahead of me. I was doing 63. Okay, so I'm just, like, going along, right? Like, look, this is what happened. Here's the cab. Well, he's going to be red. So we're, I'm driving... The cab's up. red. Yeah, so here's here's me. Here's the cab. And we're not at... This is where you would go in over here, up here, okay? So we're going at, like, a 63... Out of nowhere, right? This guy fucking comes up, no signals, and just fucking goes right across the fucking lane over into here. You can't fucking do that. You can't fucking do that. I fucking hate people that don't use their fucking, you know, their signals. Use your fucking signals. Use your fucking it's signals. Right fucking there by your where your hand is on the fucking wheel, and you know what? It's not hard. Just fucking use the damn signal and you can't fucking cut across like that. Like, what are you fucking thinking? Yeah, what are you thinking? Are you thinking? Apparently not. And, okay, here's something quickly. I was, When I was coming home from the coffee, there was this uh, tan vehicle in front of me. They were turning um, left onto over here, onto the road over here. Yeah. And, and I was, oops, I was going straight across. I was going straight across, but I had to wait. Right? Uh -huh. Okay, and you know that these people, we have the right of way. So these people on this road, even though it's a red and they could turn, you gotta watch for these people coming. Well, this fucking, it wasn't, it was just a, it was just a lady that was driving, like one of those, like her hair was all fucking done up and stuff like that. I was just sitting there because I didn't know what the fuck to do. And there's a bigger, a tin shop, you know, the tin shop, one of those trucks yeah, yeah. coming across, right? She's, like, I'm watching this before my fucking eyes, okay? So, <laughs> she's, you know, she didn't even look right, and the tin truck, I wouldn't have stopped either. Like, you got a big truck, like, you were in the right anyways. She puts on her fucking thing, her fucking, both of her fucking tires go into the fucking potholes that are right there, because she was such in a fucking right, and, and, and the tin shop guy, right, because I've seen all of this, right, I see a smile on his face, like, ear to ear, <laughs> as he's like, <laughs> But fucking, what is the damn, where is people fucking going? You know what my fucking biggest thing is? These people that bitch, oh, I have to be here at 3.30. Well, you know what? You know, at between 2.30 and 3 o'clock, it is very fucking busy. So you know what? You leave your house an extra 10 fucking minutes and you'll be there on time. Don't go fucking bitching saying how bad traffic was because you left your house 10 minutes fucking, you know, before your appointment. Don't fucking do that shit. Don't do that shit. Leave on the right time or don't fucking leave at all. Okay, so um, I was watching Days of Our Lives, <laughs> and um, my chair is by the window, so I was like looking in, like a, in the commercial would come on, and I just like look out the window, see what's going on, right? Anyways, I happen to look out, and there's this lady in a wheelchair, like over there on Russo, 
And at first I was like, I looked at it, but I was really, then I figured out like she was, she was stuck in this, like her wheelchair was stuck in the, her wheelchair was actually turned a bit into the bank because she tried yeah, to. Yeah, her truck, her truck. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck! Hey, oh, uh, I meant her wheelchair was stuck right over there across the street and all those fucking people on the welfare over there. Nobody fucking... Not one of them fucking came over to their house to fucking help her. Like, I seen her sitting there, right? I seen her, like, looking, right? There was nobody in fucking... Ra- like, sh- nobody would come out. There was people that actually passed her driving, right? Nobody stopped. So I was like, fuck, you know what? I put on my shoes and I take a jog over there. It's like, I'm just going to check the time. I don't I don't know how long we've been... Uh, rolling? Yeah, yeah, rolling, yeah. <laughs> so I... I as I got closer, I was like, "Do you need some help?" And she's, twenty minutes. She's like, she's like, "Yeah, but where did you like? How did you see me?" She said because like she was, she knew you know what I mean. Somebody that's uh, what do you call that? Old. No, she wasn't <laughs> even old. She was in oh. a she was in a wheelchair. Like oh, a, I thought a, it was an old lady. No, like um, she was probably my age, but she was uh, um, like a disabled, I guess. Like, yeah. she, it was one of the, you know, you, she couldn't get out and walk, get up and walk to move the chair. Like, she was just disabled. Okay. So, anyways, I go over. I, anyways, I said, I just live right over there. I said, so, I said, I just happened to look out my window. But you could tell that she was, you know, maybe a little bit panicking because her fucking chair was stuck in the slush. So, I was like, what do you want me to do? She's like, okay, I'm going to put it in reverse. <laughs> And I'm like, okay. No, I've never, I, I I don't know anything about those wheelchairs, okay? I didn't know they were that heavy. Yeah, they're pretty heavy, don't they? So, she's like, I need. <laughs> Is it an electric one? Yeah. Yeah, it's pretty heavy. So she goes, I'm going to put it in reverse. I need you just to just help guide it back, she says. <laughs> I said, okay. So I put my hands on the thing, right? And I see her tires spinning, right? Because it was caught up on the, the ice and the sledge. <laughs> And I'm thinking like, there's, I don't know how I'm gonna, I don't know how I'm gonna pull her back, right? Cause my shoulder for one thing, right? And you know, I, how much do you think they weigh? Those wheelchairs, would you guess? They're probably a few hundred pounds. Okay, plus you have a, a person in there on top of that, right? Yeah. And she's like, she starts, she's like, okay, hang on, right? And so she starts like, you know, wobbling in the chair, right? To help you. <laughs> and I I used everything that I had in my, in my, in my legs and in my one arm because that's what I I had this one on there but I wasn't pulling her with that I I literally like there's people still going by watching us and nobody stopped you like a fuck okay anyways and uh, anyways I got her out of there right and I I said just back up whatever and she looks ahead she goes you think I'll be able to get over there I just need to get to the stop sign because I guess it's all clear from there for her right so she I said yeah, and I looked over, and she forgot her coffee in the snowbank, so I ran up and gave her that. <laughs> it's been a, I had some adventures today. Sounds like it. I haven't been able to get in a fucking word. <laughs> Go ahead and talk. Well, I don't really have much to say, but uh, seeing you're talking about the the uh, wheelchair, yeah, that story popped into my head. We were camping in Thessalon, Ontario. A bunch of years back, I don't know how long ago, maybe 15 years ago, 20 years ago, 15 years ago. Uh, oh, probably like 19, 20 years, 19 years. It was a long time ago. It was a long time ago. Anyway, uh, my cousin's kid, he's handicapped. He said he, uh, fuck, hey, ah, uh, my words, he, uh, he rides around in one of those electric wheelchairs and we're at camp and a bunch of us were sitting around by the fire one night. Camp at, in Thessalon, Ontario. That's where we were camping. Did I say that? Well, that's where we were. Thessalon, Ontario. Uh, so anyway, my cousin's kid was over and he had a stick and he doesn't have very much use of, he can't really do much with his arms or his legs or anything like that. and he was. He had a stick and he was fiddling with it by the fire while he was sitting in his wheelchair. And he leaned a little bit too much over towards the fire and he fell into the fire. 
and he started screaming and me and Donna we do you remember that yeah we had to well yeah <laughs> there's nobody else around that was moving to help him so we we jumped up and leaped into the fire and pulled him the fuck out of there and his fucking skin was all oh, melted nice. off his fucking arms and I remember taking him out of his fucking wheelchair and having to run with him to the fucking medical thing and that was like fucking the hospital because uh, yeah, in Thessalon from where we were camping that's like fucking two football fields yeah I had to carry that kid and he was fucking he was a heavy fucker like fuck at least a hundred something fucking pounds yeah it, that was anyway so yeah I remember how heavy the wheelchair was with somebody in it it wasn't easy pulling them out of the fire that was, uh... And then a few years later, met up with him. <laughs> he pretty much told me to fuck off. <laughs> we don't get along. She left him in the fucking fire. <laughs> anyway, uh, I think that's all the time we got for today. Do you got anything else? Uh, no, I don't think so. And if you're one of the neighbors up the street, you should help people that are stuck in the snow. Don't be such dickweeds for fuck's sakes we know you guys were all home we saw you guys in your driveway for fuck's sake you seen them didn't you mm -hmm. i saw them yeah nobody even raised a fucking finger to help the lady out of the fucking snow then i did donna did I, I would have helped too, but I was taking a dump. And I wouldn't even, <laughs> like, I don't need somebody to say, oh, you're a good person or thanks or whatever. I just did it because that's what humans do most. Good. Not all humans, Donna. The good humans. You're, you're a good human. <laughs> She's a good human. Well, it's just something that you just, I don't know. You, you, I don't know. It's the thing in your head that tells you to do that stuff, and I don't understand why so many people. Just remember, if that. you live in Timmins, Ontario, and you see Donna walk around, Good human. <laughs> hey, she's a good fucking human. <laughs> well, what else do you say? Well, I don't know what you call it. Good, a good human. There's bad humans and good humans. <laughs> okay. Uh. <laughs> I think that's everything for today. I think that's everything for today. And to my cousin's son, if you're watching, fuck you, you little cocksucker. Right? Yep. That was... We even... Well, I'm not even going to go into that, but... We'll talk about it another time. Yeah. I'm going to get in my road talk. I see we got some new subscribers. Cigarette holder to you. Yes. Old subscribers. <coughs> People watching that aren't subscribed, hit the subscribe button and stick around. We upload something every day, sometimes a few things. We never leave you hanging like a cock. So, boop. Hit the button, stick around, watch some videos, get to know us, and, uh... Yeah. Hey? Hey! You're tickling me. I know what I'm doing. Well, don't. Don't do that. <laughs> <laughs> Final words, Donna. Uh, stay happy, and stay safe, and be kind. And uh, enjoy your Wednesday. And uh, if it's you know, if you're in northeastern Ontario, right? Drive with caution, because we're drive all, with caution. We're all getting hit with this rain and freezing rain. So it's raining right now. It's really raining. It's really raining. I'd show you guys the rain, but I'm sure you all seen fucking rain before. It's just rain. Yeah. It's pouring down. And Everywhere. And, uh... And on us pouring everywhere. Yeah. Mm. What did um, you say? Oh, I was saying if you're... Because the system is northeastern Ontario, <laughs> so just be careful. Just be careful regardless. Just drive <laughs> careful.
Anybody that drives, drive careful. And be good humans. <laughs> <laughs> be good humans. Yeah. And uh, I, I think that's everything. I don't think I have uh, anything else to uh, talk about. We have nothing else to talk about. So, yeah. We done? Yes. Okay. We're gonna fuck off Uda here, eh? Smoke some more weeds, drink some more beers. Smoke some more weeds. Bang. <laughs> Smoke <laughs> some more weeds. Watch some YouTube videos and um... Keep on smoking weeds. So until tomorrow, like, subscribe, and fuck off! Hey! It's good. It's good. It was a good show. You're gonna start stuff. What are we having again? The meatballs and the tomato stuff and some broccoli salad. More health shit. Yeah. Hmm. What do we need your stuff? Oh, cause I'm full. You're full. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not. That's not a. That was just from my. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> I was gonna say you're full. We'll see. <laughs> Okay, I'm out of here. You're out of here. I'm going to the... Taking about 10 steps and walk to the kitchen. Oh, actually only seven. <coughs>